Hello everybody, uh, this is Curtis. I'm going to be doing a uh, box open, a, I guess, it's pin collection opening for uh, the channel. Um, interesting enough for this box, I um, I actually only need one more Glossopod for the deck, because I wanted to build a Glossopod. Um, I didn't feel like ordering it, so I'm like, well, I'm going to go see, I know this tin, um, this special edition is supposed to come out here soon. Um, we went to Walmart, we actually saw that they had one for some reason out on display. I don't know if maybe they accidentally mixed up that product early, because it says it's supposed to come out on October 20th. Um, but if you're interested in this, um, definitely try to get up there as soon as you can, because um, I guess a lot of people are talking about this now. Um, it may be getting bought soon. People may be already getting it now. Uh, or maybe these were allowed to reach it early. I don't know. Um, but we're going to be doing an opening on today. Um, so it's pretty interesting. Um, let me see you can get your packs here. It looks like it's about to be five packs. Um, it looks like Evolutions, Burning Shadows, uh, Breakpoint, and... A breakthrough pack um not too bad burning shadow is pretty good it's uh one of the newer sets um and then it comes with a uh salazzle uh gx and a glissopod gx and obviously the wind pod and the uh the slanded um the slanded and the wind pod are not as good but it's still cool um you need something for the glissopod so i guess they figure they'll throw the lesser of the two uh, good ones in there um would not want to use it. I would use the other one, but and then um, as you see here, you also get a little uh, team's gold pin, which I think is one of their better pins. Honestly, this one's really cool. Um, but yeah, let's get into it. And open this. This part will be off the camera, so you don't have to. Yeah. You guys, pop, you guys can look at the pop figures instead. It's more entertaining. Or well, I'm cutting the the entire thing off. Oh, okay. Um, now that I'm opening it, honestly, here's the inside of it. I think that looks really cool. That artwork is actually phenomenal. Um, honestly, I might, that's actually maybe worth keeping as like a decoration. That's actually really cool. Um, I wish they'd do more stuff like this. That's actually really interesting. Um, I like the design of that a lot. It looks like graffiti, obviously, because Steam's gold. And, uh, the two of them look really cool together, actually. It doesn't look like it's, uh, copy and pasted in there as well. I mean, obviously it is, but it, it doesn't look as bad as it would be in normal copy and paste. I really like the art uh, design for that. Pull out these packs. Carefully pull out that, didn't you that? <laughs> oh, it's an actual decent shape promo. It's early. That's probably <laughs> one of the best shapes of a promo I've ever seen. It actually looks like, condition. I would say it actually looks about near min or moderate play. <laughs> that's sad that it's the best conditions. Yeah, that's one thing I do have about Pokemon I dislike. Um, it's not really their fault as much as it is just the, the what's being carried. That's definitely near mint. There's not a thing wrong with it. There's not even clamp at, uh, clamp marks on it from the plastic. That's actually crazy. Um, okay, so... Now that it's actually out, we can go over it in retrospect a little bit better, so we can actually see them. Um, here are the two basics, one for each GX, obviously. Um, one pod, which I said, like I said, isn't one of the better of the options, with the one pods you can play in standard, um, and then salad it. And then here is the, uh, obviously the Glissopod GX and the Salazzle GX. I'm actually really surprised that they're doing this. I mean, I guess I'm not really because it is one of the main characters' uh, cards, but I'm surprised they're doing well, actually like one of the better cards. They're actually still in standard rotation. This card's actually phenomenal. So I'm really happy I actually used this as a promo. And then uh, here's the awesome pin that they gave us. Um, that looks awesome. Uh, it's probably one, It actually has really good quality, too, if there's anyone else wants to collect pins. Here's the back of it. Um... It's really nice. I like this a lot. It's one of the better art designs I've seen. If you're collecting it, the only problem that you could probably see with it is um, it has an imprint stamp on the top. Um, I don't know if you can see it there, but um, it's a whenever you actually have it, it's a really noticeable circle from whatever was before it. Probably the plastic putting over it, the tape over it, or whatever. Yeah. Or paint. But it's still overall one of the better quality, um, in my opinion. And um, then here's our packs. Like I said earlier. Evolutions, Breakthrough, Sun and uh, both Sun and Burning Shadows, and then Breakpoint. Um, I'll save the Burning Shadows for last because they're the newer sets. Um, I'll, I'll knock everything over. Sorry about that, guys. All right. I just cut the part out. <laughs> okay, sorry about that, guys. Knocked over the camera to fix that. Um, but yeah, I'll do these. I'm not good at the card trick, but I'll definitely attempt it to see. Um, so do that. Or I'll keep it here so you guys are like, oh, 
The last couple of sets that I've opened, I can really tell, like, the, uh, the plastic cases were, like, a little cheaper. They've been super easy to open up, which is, it, it's a nice change because the other ones are kind of, kind of rough. The new, newer oh. sets are always kind of rough to open. I forgot Corsola was in the set. I love Corsola. You don't really see much of it anymore. Um, but there's always, uh, here's Corsola, Spike Cannon, a Skrout, a Tilly, a good Froakie, Electro Buzz, Nuzleaf, Ooh, Puzzle of time. time, that's pretty good. Aromatease, a Mag X Potion, and a Meowstic. That's pretty nice, I like that a lot. That's cool, I actually need a, uh, another holo or a Reverse Hollow Max Potion. So we'll pull out the stuff in Notable. Meowstic's pretty cool, um, not the greatest card, but it's not bad. I would attach two energy from your hand to one of your bench Pokemon. Eh, it's not too bad. It's a stage for a stage one. It is, but I do like the Pokemon in general. Yeah, I think it's pretty cool. Um, now with the evolution set, I'm actually not sure if they do it the same as the other ones. That's a good. Um, oh, sorry about that. Here you go. All right, so. I think so because they have an energy in it. Yeah. So Rattata, Charmander, Energy, Fat Pikachu, Growlithe, Rock's Gift. Maintenance, switch, Mewtwo, and a Nidoking King break. Not worth anything, but it's a really cool pill. Pool. I actually need more of these because I have a fun deck for Nidoking. King. Um, it's obviously not good, but it is standard legal. Um, I'll probably make a list for it eventually. Um, I do have a list for it. I mean, like in real life, I have it on the TCG itself. Um, but it definitely is a cool card. It's not a great card, but it's definitely standard legal for right now. I do enjoy it. There we go. That. That's not bad. And then breakthrough. And there's Hound Doom. Hound Doom's a really cool card. I have a promo from the uh, the Team Rocket set, and I love it so much. And uh, I'm sorry that I'm not giving you guys any of the promo, like the the cards themselves, like the uh, promo cards. I'm still trying to get some stuff into TCG. Once I start going TCGO and it will mess around and stuff, I'll start probably giving these codes out. I won't need them as much then. Um, and I would really like to start doing that for you guys, so you guys have something to look forward to these, and then you're just watching to see what we get. I oh, saw something hollow there, sorry about that. Scatterbug, Ketnia, Snubble, uh, Cubone, Magnite, Behemon, Scramble, Judge, not bad. Magneton, that's an interesting card, and Marowak. Okay, and then on to the Burning Shadows. Hopefully we can pull... Um, something from here. There's a lot of good cards in this set. If I can open it. Trying for the Avoid Guzma. Yeah, I would actually really love a four Guzma. I just want to art for Guzma. Or even just Guzma. I actually need a couple more. So I'll be okay with eating like a common at this point. Oh, I got getting the full art released. <laughs> from the code. Holy Bat. Salk. Esper. Fan Sage. Pampor. Whirlpeed. Electabuzz. Super Scoop. Rotom Dex. Hey, Heracross. Um, this card's actually interesting. Um, there's a Dark Integral did a video in this. Um, this card's actually really cool. Um, the Guts ability, uh, this Pokemon will be knocked out by damage or from an attack, flip a coin. If heads, this Pokemon is not knocked out, and its remaining HP becomes 10. That's really cool because after a while, over and over again, um, you're able to just uh, keep the Pokemon alive, and you can start uh, stacking up for like one or two shot after a while. It's not bad. I like it. It's an interesting deck if you want to go check it out. And then Burning Shadows, I guess. Like I guess I. And sorry about opening it up on camera. I have a hard time opening these packs. For some reason, these packs give me a really hard time. Let's see if I can do this right again. I doubt I am. I think I've done these wrong every single pack so far. So. <laughs> Rattata, Charmander, Pantsier, Pikachu, Krogunk, Pikachu, Gloom, Urusil. Acerola, <laughs> Boba Fett, Energy, and Toxic Croak. So not the best pulls. Um, I got a break, which is kind of cool, and some um, some other things. The Quest of GX. Um, normally they're about ten dollars, anyways. About eight around there, I think they are. Um, as of this video. So even then, you get your value back from that. Um, you have a chance of getting really good cards, obviously in the pack. It's not. I wouldn't necessarily be getting this constantly. You get stuff for TCGO, which is also really cool. Um, but. Money wise, it's still cheaper to get the single, but it's always really cool stuff to pull. Um, and uh, I have a lot of fun opening things like this. 
but I, I appreciate everyone for watching and tuning in. Um, like I said, once I start rolling and getting things going, um, hopefully I will be able to start giving these codes out. Um, I should be able to do that soon. It won't, shouldn't be much longer. Just uh, summary and and uh, before I head out, um, I'll show everything that we pulled there. It's worth really, I guess, pointing out. Okay. Aside from the commons, um, we got this reverse hollow max potion, uh, the new king break, which I'm surprised to pull a break from that. Uh, Glitzapod GX from the set, reverse hollow Pikachu, which is kind of cool. I like that artwork a lot. The Salazzle GX, and then the two uh, other promos, which are hollows. I think these are the only hollows of this card actually, um, which is kind of standard. And then the uh, puzzle time, which is really good for ex for expanded uh, for expanded format. Um. But yeah, I thank you guys for watching and I hope you guys have a great day.